Hello and welcome to today's news bulletin for Biospectrum. Let's have a look at today's headlines. IIT Kharagpur to start a first of its kind genomics lab in India. Samsung Bio app is to fund and develop original biotech drugs in partnership with Takeda. New Novartis drug to aim at drug resistant malaria. IIT Kharagpur plans to start a genomics lab facility for students from all the branches of engineering. The main objective of this facility will be to teach all the students at the second year the basic techniques like microscopy based observation, molecular biology, protein structure and function and bioinformatics. From third year onwards, students will be allowed to plan and execute experiments by their own under the mentorship of faculties from various fields. The lab will be equipped with all the essential equipment needed to carry out experiments in cell and molecular biology, biochemistry, etc. Mr. Sudeep Ghosh, who will be heading the lab, opined that although there are few labs of similar nature abroad, this will be the first of its kind in India. In addition, IIT Kharagpur also plans to collaborate with Tata Medical Center to promote interaction between faculty, medical professionals and students and carry out joint academic and research programs. The institute is planning to launch an integrated MSc PhD program, which would be jointly developed by both institutions. Samsung Bio Apis, a part of the South Korean conglomerate Samsung Group's biopharmaceutical, has announced that it will fund and develop multiple original drugs in partnership with Japan's Takeda Pharmaceutical Company Limited. The partnership will develop novel biologic drugs in unmet disease areas and the two companies will immediately begin working on a treatment for severe acute pancreatitis. The other terms of the development program were not disclosed. Samsung Group hopes the biosimilars business will develop into a new growth driver as global demand for smartphones slows, weighing on the outlook for the mobile business of flagship firm Samsung Electronics. Novartis is aiming at drug-resistant malaria by launching clinical trials of the first new anti-malarial medicine for many years in nine countries across Africa and Asia. The company is working on the mid-stage phase 2B trial program with the group Medicines for Malaria Venture. The drug KAF-156 belongs to a novel class of anti-malarial compounds called imidazolopiperazine and is designed to be used in combination with an improved formulation of the existing anti-malarial rumefentry. Deaths from malaria have fallen sharply since 2000. However, WHO estimates that there were around 4 lakh fatal cases in 2015, most of them in African children. That's all for today. Thank you. For more videos, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Biospectrum Media.